I'm there to hurt and you know put on an exciting show for the fight fans of, of the whole entire world. So you know what? Let's, let's just show who has a bigger heart. Let's let's go in there and just throw it down. If we're both coming off losses to Navarrete, so we're both here to sort of prove our point and that we've still got it. I mean, I'm still young. I've definitely got it. He's, I wouldn't say he's on the back end, back end of his career, but he's he's already done all the good things. He's you know, been world champion twice, and he'd still like to redeem himself to show the world that he that he's still got it. So I think the fight with me and him is going to be an absolute barn burner. And I've always had that sort of style in me. I've always had that sort of mentality of come to fight, come to win, doesn't matter who you are. And I'm, I'm so excited. Come back and come back strong and, and go for my dream, just, which is to become a world champion this year. Before that, I got to beat Leon Wilson, which I know is not an easy fight. He's a, he's a tough fighter. But I don't think he wants it more than I do, man. I, I want this like, like nothing else. You, you got you to gotta want it as much as you want to breathe, as you want to you know, do anything in life. And uh, one thing that, that, that I know about myself is that I'm one, I'm one dedicated fighter. You know, like I said to a few people back home, my idols, Morales, Marquez, I'm essentially fighting the modern day era of them too. You know, the Navarrete, Valdez, and I have so much pride and mm. so much pride in that. And, um, you know, I, I probably should have won the with I probably should have won the first fight with Navarrete, but um, we're we're going we're, we're going we're going to win this one. We share the same idols. <laughs> we we share the same uh, styles as far as what we want for the fans, which is a good fights, you know. But styles make fights, so we're only hoping. I'm only hoping that you know the first version of, of of Leon Wilson, that version that I saw him against Vaquero Navarrete. I was there when he fought him. I was there when he sent him to the canvas. A lot of people thought that. He should have won the fight because he had him very, very hurt. So I know Leon Wilson is a tough fighter. I got nothing but respect for him as a fighter, as a person. But um, I'm working very hard because um, this fight, you know, it all comes to who wants it the most. Who wants it the most, who's working harder, who's who has the bigger heart inside the ring. And better believe that I'm coming with everything. I'm, I'm hungrier than ever. I'm, uh, I, know what it, I know what it takes. I know what it feels like to be a world champion, to have multiple uh, defense in, in the divisions and 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 know what it is and i miss that i miss being a champion I miss that feeling proud of myself being the campeon and this is my opportunity to go back in there again we know whoever wins this fight is a step closer to to a world title fight so whoever wins is a step closer whoever loses will take a couple of steps back which will make them even harder to come back in the game so this fight means all all or nothing for me for this fight like i'm excited i want to I, I think I agree with you as well. I think it's going to be a I think it's going to be a war. That's exactly why I'm here putting in the hard work. I want to. I had a few a few reporters ask me back home in Australia, how do you feel going back to the De Desert Diamond Arena back in Arizona? And I said, I wouldn't want it any other way. I want to go exactly back there. I want this fight there. I want to leave that place a winner this time. And for that, I'm putting in the hard work. I'm getting ready for March 29. And I take so much pride in my fighting style. Um, I feel like the fans appreciate it. They have for many years. And they're going to do that again on uh, March 29. Like you said, uh, I was surprised to hear that Leon Wilson, his idols are, are someone like Eric Morales, Marco Tera Barrera, because um, those are my idols too. You know, we grew, we grew up watching them. And I've always wanted it to be somewhat similar to them when it comes to being that warrior, that guy that gives it all inside the ring. And, Better believe that, you know, that dream is still on and I'm going to give him my best to to one day inspire the new generation like Eric Morales and Marco Antonio Barrera inspired myself. And uh, before I let you go. Yeah, look, I'm in, I'm in again in a really tough fight against uh, a great champion in Valdez. Make sure everybody tunes in. Um, I, I put my my heart and soul into the sport. Um, I put everything on the line when I hop in that ring. I, I, I always try and win. You know, I don't try and tip tap and you know get through to 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 the decision i'm there to hurt and you know put on an exciting show for the fight fans of of the whole entire world so please tune in and good things gonna come on march 29 thank you oh, man. just um just hope the best let's just, 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 just give the fans what they want a good fight it's, that's the most important thing let um God be with you, and let's let's get off the ring healthy wise and with with good health. But 
Just give the fans what they want. A good fight. Get the go. Thank <laughs> you.